Ooh, let's see what he. That is not the vintage I asked for, you half wit ox. No matter, just set it down. Leave both bottles and get out. I'm trying to write my memoirs. <laughs> I wanted chocolate milk, Mom. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this strawberry? Idiot. The plague has all but stopped shipping, except for a few whale boats. Miserable conditions right now, I'd imagine. If the crews of whaling ships continue getting infected, we may run low on whale oil. And without that, we will enter a very dark age. There is word that raiders on the outskirts of the city have become more and more brazen in their raids. Gangs inside, raiders outside. What a world. Damn this old war wound in my hip. Son of a gun, it aches these days. <laughs> now, some of this is uh, specific to the High Chaos playthrough. Blood's been flowing in the streets. Yes. The storm drains are running red. No point in holding back now, huh? The Abbey <coughs> has suspended funeral services. There were simply too many of them to conduct any other business. <laughs> as of late, I have treated every sunset as if it were our last. The stench from the river is reaching farther and farther into the city every day. More and more corpses. Do you ever feel that the ghosts of the past are following you? Sometimes I feel them. <coughs> yeah, now some of those are specific. Here's, here's the Dunball Tower. Some of those are specific to High Chaos. Have like Entry 5. Teague Martin is now High Overseer. He is a clever one, and his ideas have taken us very far. Considering where he comes from, he should be very pleased with himself. Now we can be assured that the Overseers will support our, will support our claims, whatever they may be. There's only one man now standing between us and complete control of the Empire. The Lord Regent will soon find himself staring into that hideous mask of Corvos. Of that I have no doubt. But what happens after that? But yeah, a lot of that stuff talking about, you know, blood pouring in the streets and, you know, chaos outside the city. Some of that is specific to the high chaos run, because generally, the higher the chaos is, the shittier the world in general gets. And the shittier the outlook, apparently. Yeah. Because that guy was like, blood is running like a river, what's the point? Yeah. What the hell? Yeah. Like, basically, the darker you, you are, sort of the darker the world around you becomes. Remember earlier, like sure, those uh, those overseers. One of the one of their fellow overseers was sick. In high chaos, they just yeah. murder him. But in low chaos, he comes to them and tells them he wants to sacrifice okay. himself. Offers to sacrifice now himself. We've done away with a woman and a noble woman at that. That prayed to her side. Yeah. She helped the Lord Regent kill the Empress. So I don't feel a thing for her. All right, here, here. Personally, I heard you upheld my name in a rather spectacular style and add some risk to yourself. I want to thank you for. This little item has been helpful to my family over the generations. But I think you'll find more use for it than I ever will. Go on. Take it. You've had a long night, Corvo. But I fear it's not over. Havelock and Martin have already cooked up something more for you. They would like to see you now. In Havelock's chambers above the bar. Hey, a room, another room. Attention, Dunwall citizens. You are urged to <coughs> children. Do you think people in real life need as much prompting to take things from other people as they do in video games? <laughs> Not in my experience. Then again, some seriously in. Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. No, you go. Ahead. All right then. I've forgotten what I was uh, going to say at this point. <laughs> I was just gonna say that never in my life has somebody like held something out and like to somebody else mm -hmm. and been like, "Go on, take it, take it." Yeah, let's see what's going on what here. What are you waiting now? for? Hey, uh, audio graph player. Yes, yes, I tell her you will still need to study, and as empress, you'll have proper tutors, one for each subject, and many personal servants. She asks if she'll have spies. Yes, I tell her. I suppose you will, and advisors. So many advisors are heavy spin. She wants a cake maker. Well, I tell her you'll have a whole kitchen staff with an army of chefs. And of course she asks if she can have cake every, every day. 
she's been drawing pictures of her of her father figure Corvo over there. <laughs> this is that change is depending on high chaos. On high chaos. If you're in low chaos, she does not draw you as a horrible rat beast. Atop a throne of skulls or whatever that was over there. No, when you're on low chaos, I'm fairly certain she draws you just holding her hand. Hello, yeah, it says, I yeah. I am Calista, and I am Emily's teacher, and this is my lesson plan. Boring sums, boring history, boring geography, boring, boring, boring seven structures. Hang on. Ugh, why can't we study sword fighting, and sailing, and, and monsters? Emily's bored with her studies, it seems. Not the academic type. She's a killer, like her old man. Or possible. Look <laughs> at that poster. Sokolov's elixir. I didn't get a good look at it. What did it say? It's Sokolov's elixir. It's like a vial of the elixir with like these big muscular arms coming out of it. <laughs> Where is Emily herself, though? That is beautiful there. Let's get a closer look at that picture, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> I assume there's me, and what? What there, there's my countless victims. There's some... There's my little friends. Did it say guilty? No, Emily. Emily. And I've just got a skull face. Well, is she... What's that? It always really bothers me. How old is she supposed to be? Like nine, right? I think so. Whoa! Look at that one! Oof. Giant rat. Are you dying? I don't know. It looks like it looks like it's a is that me? If it's that's me, it looks like I'm in trouble. Yeah, looks like you're about to get eaten by a giant ass rat. Interesting. No, no. Or is that the Empress? I think so. She got know. eaten by a rat. Disturbing. Well, that's not what. That's not one for the fridge. I think. No. So you're saying something about Emily's age? Oh, she drew. She drew her E backwards. Like, that's not like a common thing. Kids well, don't heard... mix up what direction the E is supposed to go. Well, you heard her. You heard her bitching about how much she hates school. Maybe she's just really dumb. <laughs> <laughs> or, 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 less harshly, just perhaps, you know, not very scholarly. <laughs> I don't, I can't, it's so hard to remember which side the E goes. Hello to you, Corvo. I imagine you made that masquerade a lively event. I there would be another <laughs> He's talking over himself now. I know. Do you need me to build something for you? I can make anything. Practically. Alright, we got a lot of money, so we can... get a lot of upgrades. And as I've said before, I've never really find the need to buy equipment, buy ammunition. Or expendables. Yeah. Just, so, you, so, um... Tell me about this coal-powered Sibian. <laughs> no, don't! <laughs> People are going to have no idea what you're talking about if they haven't seen the earlier video. And the people who have seen the earlier video probably stopped watching before this one, so... <laughs> I just wish I would stop talking about it. <laughs> yeah, so, boosting up my weapons, improved armor... More bullets... Grenade capacity, because why not? I'm running low on stuff to to get. The academy doesn't have anything that will refine to the 
Now keep in mind, that's the voice of Chucky there. Yes. James and Co. Preston Club. Oh, Piero's Door to Nowhere. Remember that? No. In, in one of his, in one of those like notes by him, or one of his letters, he was talking about. You know, you may laugh at my Door to Nowhere now, but someday. <laughs> Piero, <coughs> the Door to Nowhere has proven to be a safety hazard, but for me, this project is an endless source of inspiration. With a proper application of energies, I believe I can transform the door frame into a window of sorts. One that will allow a traveler to cover the distance from any from my workshop to some distant, arbitrary point at a single step. Okay, that's right, so it is like a teleportation thing. Currently, the step leads to a sheer drop, straight down into the courtyard. But in time, it will bridge gaps that will boggle the mind. Such work is many years away, to be sure. But if I survive this plague, I'm sure to succeed. <laughs> Right now, if you step out, then you'll just die. But... <laughs> one day. I feel confident that the answer will come to me tonight. Like, I really wish that there were people who were completely isolated from... Yeah, let's, let's hear this properly this time. Copper wiring is making all the difference. Increasing the output by almost 50. Yet. The whale oil still has too many impurities. I need to find a way to filter it myself if that idiot can't provide a better grade. Even the Academy doesn't have anything that will refine it to the specifications I require. Something new then. Perhaps using charcoal or a multiple chambered device. I don't want to think about Piero using multi chambered devices for things now. <laughs> Remember, he's been having weird dreams. Yeah. The strange black-eyed man. I I would love to find a person who's completely been isolated from pop media, mm -hmm. and like try and ask them to build some, like feasibly build something like that, like a scientist who's like never heard of anything related to teleportation, mm -hmm. and then ask, you know how would you build a door that when you open it it transports you to another door. Far away. Oh, there's closer. Emily's hiding again. It started as a game, but it's turned into her way of teasing me. If you see her, will you send her back to me? It's time for her studies. Sounds like somebody sucks at hide and seek. <laughs> yeah. No wonder. Em no wonder Emily can't sp can't r can't write her letters if this is her teacher. I know. No such God. thing as bad students. You can run, Emily. You'll only die tired. <laughs> okay, that, 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 that was a little mutt. That was a little dark. 